or good to see you again. I've been doing all this kind of stuff on here, but well, I mean, this kind of works out there because I'm gonna tell you, Syrups Steve is slick as looks real good. All right, well, here we go. Getting into PS2. God, we just need to get rid of this stage. Yeah, we just I mean, we just need to get rid of it. It's good for Steve too. That's the crazy oh, no, part. No, no, it, it's a good stage in general for for some characters, but like the <laughs> I'm just gonna continue pushing my my agenda, my propaganda. But the fact that everyone's just willing to go to this stage, like no questions asked, sometimes is just absolutely mind boggling. We do we are so sick of the meta, but we just keep running at the PS2. I do not get it. Yeah, you know, change is hard. It's also not comfortable. So I wanted us to kind of stick onto there, but Sierra adapting to that chain, geez, that was a lot of shield damage, trying to get that set up, but Undead, Rain Dead, trying to get a set up down there, the up tilt, gonna get parried out, but no punish just yet. But Sierra just looking for a straight aerial, honestly, and there we go, cashes out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Syrup's been going like really crazy lately too. I mean, it's been like, I think all Steve, right? I don't think we've mm -hmm. seen Ness pop up in like the slightest bit. Uh -oh. um, and it, I mean, it definitely works out for him. I mean, you know, player under 20 years old is going to be going absolutely insane and playing like a top player in no time. <laughs> mm -hmm. Exactly. You, you got, but that's, the, there's an age limit. There is like the height limit on a roller coaster. You got to be this young to play. <laughs> <laughs> Kinda, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like that's a Lego the, set. That's not the takeaway from Syrup's ability though, because Syrup's been absolutely dominant in Tri-State for a long time, even before Steve was even hinted at. Uh, mm -hmm. But right now, okay, get, small little jab there. I love that. Seeing if there was a panic air dodge in there. Mm -hmm. stuff on awareness on Syrup, but honestly, you're just looking for chip damage. If you get a stock, you get a stock, which just kind of has diamonds ready to go, just kind of going for the resources and just kind of boxing it out there. Gets a grab and reward it with it. Now, you got to escape this ledge while Syrup just coming to the city back. So I'm going to just get some more resources while I'm at it. Wow. Yeah, up smash, not going to be able to take the stock right there, but the dash tech, all right. And you know what I'm just realizing here, too, is that he's playing Simon. You know, how often do we see Simon at all, ever? Everybody just opts for Richter. Yeah. I mean, the better looking one, in my opinion. So I understand why Richter is being picked out on there, but Simon trying to find their way in, does secure it out there. I know the down special has different properties. Does it detonate TNT, question mark? Uh, I doubt it. Yeah, it, it should. It's fire. Yeah, it's fire. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I know what Diamond Forward Air does. Mm -hmm. it <laughs> takes that stock that quick. I mean, the other side of it is just like, it's an interesting matchup too. I feel like, Undead Brain Dead is probably spending a little bit too much time uh, off the ground. <laughs> like I know like downward angled, like forward air or back air or whatever is like a really, really good option. But I feel like being a bit more grounded here, utilizing that forward tilt, um, try, just trying to force Syrup to play more defensive. I feel like it's just such a huge boon for what the Belmonts want to do. Yeah, that's real rough too. I was just acting that cause like Richter, you know how it's like aura properties? On the down special i mean it's just it's just aura as in like the uh it's not fire it does not have the actual aura properties at all ah gotcha i got gotcha. you yeah. because i was thinking about big, the pick the yeah. thing about pikmin interaction yeah i was just wondering no, it, yeah that, that, that's all it is because i remember like it technically has it's considered aura and people would argue like oh yeah it does more damage so he's better than uh than simon and that's just not how it works mm -hmm. at all <laughs> gotcha we ain't spreading misinformation here we got skiff on we got society skiff i'm just scene. surprised that it's 2023 and i still heard that mm -hmm. <laughs> making sure and oh goodness you know what's still turned there oh look at this oh my god cash is out there can't you believe it? you oh. mess up the combo and you still get all that damage on there instead of dying I mean, uh -oh. to be fair, oh, yeah, that, <laughs> that was a shield that break. Was a so it was over. It was yeah, over. I mean, yeah, if you didn't take the stock, you were just getting your shield broken straight up. Oh, he oh, said, look, he I got it. my down B forward smash too. And it just did not work. <laughs> it's the shield breaker at home. He's like, I got it too. And he's yeah. like, oh, you don't exactly have it on there. <laughs> I move on, man. Vanilla, vanilla ultimate. That was scary. The first like week people were playing this character online and we were just like, how, how good is this character really? Is this a top 15 character? Oh yeah, nope. <laughs> you remember King K. Rool? They oh, nerfed yeah. the berry timer because everyone's just like, this character's broken, yikes. And now we got golden tools out here, Syrup, Dom. No, that was <laughs> what yo, the was that? Was, that was kind of <laughs> sick, yo. He was hitting the whips. He was uh, basically wave dashing in the air. And he can do anything. Oh my God, just snatch him out of there with that fishing pole. Look at just kind of just roaming around doing everything he can. Now gets diamonds out there saying, well, Good luck approaching me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is definitely a little bit rough here. I think there's, I don't know what the actual matchup is between these two characters, but I just feel like just watching this, that it might not be good for Belmonts at all. <laughs> oh, tr oh, trust me. I, I was, I remember me and Dom were on the same team. And I'm like, oh, yeah, coach. that's right. Yeah, you are familiar with Dom. Mm -hmm. I do plenty of VOD review and I was doing the Steve because he, he had a double Steve up ahead. And I was like, Dom, this is just going to suck. But here's what you can do. <laughs> <laughs> and that, that was just all I could do. I definitely was able to cut it out there. But Syrup is just an unrelenting hurricane of damage and I'm dead right there. It's just trying to find somebody to stop something, but Syrup with three stocks, it's just looking real rough. Ouch! Yep. <laughs> yeah, big old three stock to close that one out. And like, yeah, man, look, I know some people are going to look at that and be like, look what Steve does. I'm like, well, yeah, that's also just matchup issues at that point. Like, mm -hmm. what is Belmont legitimately supposed to do there? Like, Belmont struggles with a lot of characters. Like, he has a lot of great tools for setups and, like, getting some crazy combos, but he also just struggles in some scenarios. Plus, Syrup was just also... No offense, Undead Brain Dead. Syrup was just out playing the hell out of him. Oh, yeah. It was just all over, like, why on rice? There's just nothing you can do and just keep on going there. And yeah, like the the F, the different FDs use like mm -hmm. the Omega version for like mining materials. I've been hearing like a little comment on there. Got real careful, but yeah, cheese. It's just, Syrup is just like in control the entire time. And I just realized that was a six stock too. Oh, I just realized that too. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. So the fact that they actually went here to Shadow Moses Island, uh, that actually forces Syrup to use uh, the pickaxe yes. for getting materials instead of the shovel. Mm -hmm. Just smart. I like that. But yeah, but that's just like that's that's technically like <laughs> that's kind of breaking the rules. <laughs> yeah. Syrup, Syrup literally just said that's cool, bro. I'm yeah, just... and then Syrup beat him even harder. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> Syrup's just like, we'll be upon the three stock again. <laughs> That's yeah, real that was, rough on there. Dude, how is this camera getting worse, man? You Somebody look, you, said it looks like I'm a, I'm in a hostage situation here. No, nah, you're right. You look like you, you look like funny. the you look like the hidden footage of like the the Blair Witch Project. <laughs> <laughs> I look that pale there too, man. Look at this. You, like if I turn just right, it's like you can't even tell I have a nose. There, there you can tell I have a nose. Look at See, that. Skiff's <laughs> Skiff's actually not here. He's just gone. I look like a marble statue. <laughs> Damn. I am not sculpted the way that they look and how perfect those statues look, but I am definitely looking as pale as one right now. But either way, fantastic winter side top eight at the moment. Uh, honestly, there's a couple just really solid matches some great gameplay back and forth between the two. Uh, but we got another tried and true uh, fusion certified Jackal Syrup winner's finals. Yep. Seed number one and two impacting directly onto there and both these players have been playing well. I mean, I'm going to be real. Like, the Jackal Haven, it got me on the edge of my seat. Syrup and on that brain dead. Syrup says, well, that's cool. Six stock will be upon the enemy. It's a rough one. But at the mm -hmm. same time, Jackal has been able to pilot around this DLC character. So I think the best showing of that one 